I do like this little temptation here where you kind of trade knights really early there because they don't... Uh, black doesn't have a good defense, or sorry, a good attack for this right here. Um, I want to take this. I know the, the engine always wants me to take the d4 pawn here at the start i've just i've just gotten to know that but i have other ideas in mind i think the engine's going to tell me that that's a mistake really I'm gonna go ahead and castle here. Uh, I'm gonna make sure I don't get too behind on development. I don't know why he put his bishop here. That kind of doesn't really give his bishop a lot of space. Oh, really? That's interesting. Kind of okay if he takes this. This will give me a really nice jump for my knight. I think I'm just gonna look for, yeah, I was expecting that. I think I'm just gonna look, oops. I think I'm gonna look for this move right here. We'll see what he does to get away from that. Um, that's fine. He can have that. I, I'm willing to trade. I'm willing to trade there. I'm willing to give up the knight for the bishop there, or for the rook there, excuse me. He probably has to go here. Really? Uh, let's think about this. Um, I guess I could just recapture here. That just seems too easy to not take this, but I would really like his rook. I think he'll just recapture with the queen, and then I'll take his bishop, which I'm okay with. If he takes this pawn here, which I don't think he will, I'll just take with the queen. But I'm pretty sure he's just going to do this. Tea break. That makes sense too. I didn't really see that move. That's interesting. Why would he want to do that? 
That just seems like it's so easy to defend. I could deliver him check. That's not great. Um, Probably a misplay there. His queen and his rook are pretty inactive. Then again, so are mine. Yeah, I, I'm not really sure what the point of that move was. Maybe this is a mistake since he still has a dark square bishop. Oh, speaking of dark square bishops. Should I challenge this? No, he has two attackers, I only have one. I feel like I need to get my queen here. Ew. This is really the only move, right? Yeah. My light square bishop is in a really bad spot. All my pawns are on light squares, and it's like the only thing sitting. Well, no, my pawns are on light squares. Yeah, he's just defending his pawn here, and my bishop is on a light is on a light square. That's not great. I think I'll just start trying to put pressure on his king. Oh boy. Well, I guess I have no choice, huh? That's a pretty good move from him. This seems really tempting, but I almost wonder if it's better to just start attacking him from this angle. I do have a free piece here. This does attack his dark square bishop as well. He has this pass pawn situation going on here. Uh, that's actually really good for me. Oh, he's trying to defend. Yeah, that's fine. I feel like that was a really good move for me. I could just sack this. I think I'm just gonna sack that. I like my rook's position. I feel like it's adding pressure to his king, so I don't really wanna move it at the moment.
don't really care about the past pawn at the moment. What to do? Um, I'll just go for some shenanigans. We'll see what happens. It's probably not to play, but whatever. He'll probably, will he go in the corner? I don't know if he'll go in the corner, but I can just, my bishop here can escape. Seems reasonable. Oh, I actually have, uh, do I just straight up have checkmate? I just win. Let's see. I think I won. Oh, that's cool. GG. I wonder where he went wrong. I feel like he had such an advantage there for a while. I played like a 600. Nice. I think this was a really good move. Ah. I don't know why, but I just feel like this is a, this is a good move for some reason. I feel like it was a good trade. Yeah, I wasn't really sure what to do here. Um, when I've seen this position before, or like something similar, the engine always seems to want to go this way. So I'm actually glad to see that this was a good move by me. That's good. Yeah, I don't really understand why this is a good move. I guess it's because it puts him into a place where he can't castle because he has to move his king. That's my only guess. But I, I don't really understand why you'd want to just like sack your bishop here or sacrifice your bishop for a pawn. That doesn't really make sense to me. I was trying to go for something clever here, but it didn't really work out. I don't really get why the engine wants this too, because he can just recapture with the with the rook there so easily, and there's nothing I can do about it. So I don't I don't fully understand that. Maybe I can just do this. Maybe I don't know. Yeah, this seemed like a mistake by him because he just stacked his pawns for no reason. And I had a really easy capture with the knight there. That just makes sense. Trading a bishop for a rook. Yeah, I was going back and forth between this move and this move, but it seemed like it'd be really easy for him just to move his bishop back. And then if I move my pawn up, I wouldn't be in a great spot because even if I were to capture his queen after his pawn takes, uh, he can just use his knight to recapture there. So that didn't really make sense to me. I don't really get why this is a blunder. He definitely should have taken with the pawn here though, because even if I captured with the queen, he could just attack there. So yeah, definitely should have used. Even then, even if he took with his pawn, I would have just taken his queen because his knight was out of the way now. 
And then I would have just blocked his pass pawn with one of the rooks, probably this one. So I'm not quite sure. Anyways. Yeah, this probably wasn't the play. I really, I really, I, will, I wanted to leave the rook here to add pressure to this file in case I move this pawn up and then um, capture it this way. Or capture it this way. Yeah, this just seemed like a big mistake there. I don't feel like he had like a solid plan going forward since uh, this pawn was defended. Didn't like that move. It's understandable. Um, what did I do there? Yeah. I felt like this was okay, actually. This queen move to a2. This move didn't really make a whole lot of sense to me. I wasn't quite sure where he was going with this one. I guess he was just trying to take this bishop, but it didn't seem like it was a, such a big threat at the moment. And then he really put his queen kind of into a bit of a corner there. And plus it opened up checkmate, so that wasn't great either. I wonder what he could have done here. Yeah, I think I think his bet his best bet would have been to just offer a queen trade. That's my only guess. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, it's a pretty fun game, and I'll see you guys in the next one.